The stick and bucket circuits are oriented as to rod and bore sides of their respective cylinders. When you connect a circuit to the shear, take care to connect rod to rod and bore to bore. When these are reversed, extra pressure is needed to open the jaw, which pulls down the engine, de-strokes the pumps, increases jaw cycle time, creates high oil temperatures, and burns more fuel. The shear must be vertical before putting oil into it, or an air lock in the regen valve may prevent the jaw from opening. Be sure hydraulic pressure is relieved before disconnecting hydraulic fittings. Remove the fitting slowly. Once the shear is mounted on the excavator, install the hydraulic supply and return hoses from the excavator to the shear's manifold blocks as shown in your owner's manual.